Um, hello, hello gamers. Back, back today with this game called Arcade Paradise. I don't really know much about it. I think it came out. It came out yesterday. Also, I don't know if there's supposed to be music. But here we are. Hello, Deffin. Hello, Nutritious. Hello, Duck and Denji. Welcome. It's Friday. Yo, it's Friday. Anyway, uh, based on what little I know about this game. I literally got recommended an article today on, you know, like when you have your Google phone and you scroll to the left of your homepage, your home screen. They have a bunch of like random articles and then there was like an article about this game. It's like, oh, look, this is a, this is a game where you have a, you have a laundromat and you turn it into an arcade. And so as you can see, there is a laundry thing right here. Got a bunch of arcade machines. <clears throat> So I was originally going to play Cult of the Lamb today, but I I was watching other people play it and I tried doing the Twitch, Twitch integration and it seems like they were having issues. And so I just, uh, I gave up. I chose to play this game instead. I bought it. It seems like it'd be a good game just to like, you know, do nothing, right? You can, there's, there's gameplay of this game. Where you're basically doing laundry. You're doing laundry, you're doing some other stuff. Yeah, the servers are overloaded. Simply, I tried to connect my Twitch account to, to Cult of the Lamb, and it just didn't work. Anyway, yes, I was going to name my cult Cult of the Wolf. So is there supposed to be audio? <laughs> I can't, I can't tell. Am I just not hearing things? What's going on? There should, there should be audio, music, back. Like, I'm assuming these menus are supposed to be making sounds, right? Is this true? Is this true? Um, Elgato, audio. And I guess we'll see when we start the game. Continue? Wait, I never, I didn't make a new game. What do you mean, continue? Never started. Oh, there's a, there's... Wait, oh, wait, wait, hold on, hold on. Wait, I think I know what it is. Because I was playing in VR before. Can I pause this? I would like to not... I... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I know what the issue is. The virtual desktop audio? No, this one. There we go. And I think it's playing from the wrong... Did you guys hear that? Hold on, okay, there you go. There it is. Hold on, I want, I want to restart this. I'm gonna listen to some audio. I'm gonna alt F4. <laughs> Just gonna close the game. Oh, there's an update? Okay, well. I guess we're going. Sorry, there was supposed to be audio. This whole time. Yeah, there you go. They got... There's the credits. There's the people who made the game. Nosebleed Interactive. Oh, there you go. Okay. That sounds good. Yeah, we were missing out on this jam the whole time. Alright. I don't know if this is like a keyboard mouse kind of game or controller. It seems like there's some parts where I have to walk around. So, I don't know. Yo, look at this music. Listen to that music. I think the lore is that there's a guy, his family owns a laundromat. And he has dreams of turning it into an arcade. So this is a guy. Here's a guy. Check out that stuff in the background. Wow, there's there's the creators again. Look at these lines. Yo, Laundry, Ash? Ash from Pokemon? Pizza King? Oh, uh, my air conditioner is still on. I didn't have it on today, but I turned it on before the stream because it might it might be kind of hot. As usually when I stream, I, I close my door, which reduces the air circulation. And so having it on is, is good. Yo, there's the game. I see, this is a reference to MTV. Instead it says NTV, like... Nosebleed television. I hope this audio isn't copyrighted. <laughs> Wouldn't it suck if this audio is copyrighted? I Maybe I should have checked, I don't know. 
Is it safe to stream this game? This game came out... Uh, oh, look at that Among Us. This trash can right here. <laughs> That's Among Us? Okay, you missed. Nah, don't get that. Is MTV still around? I actually don't, I don't know. I have no idea. Even back then, like... Uh, <laughs> Back then, MTV didn't really do much music, right? They did a bunch of random other shows that were unrelated to music. <clears throat> yes, actual Among Us. Anyway, welcome to Arcade Paradise. Use, okay, use the mouse to move around. Use Wazda to enter. Okay, that's the bus stop. Look at that duck. Yo, duck. You got duck in chat. Eat a duck, I must. The Drooks. There's some ducks. It looks a little grainy. That's just, that's the aesthetic. That's how they do it. Check that out. Twitch reference? What do you mean? Twitch? Here's a downtown Main Street, Main Street bus service. There's Duck. DRG, you guys know? Check that out. I want to mow this lawn. <laughs> lawn mowing simulator has taught me. I would like to mow some things. Get the bus to discontinue. Okay, let's go inside the laundromat. Yo, this is our laundromat. <clears throat> An achievement already? Ashley. Oh, Ash. I see. Ashley. Ash. Hello, Lofki and Deadman. Welcome. Shrewd. Among? Did he say Among? <laughs> Did he say among? Let's go over the basics one more time. All right. Pay attention. First, take a basket of laundry and load it into an empty basket. Take a basket of laundry. Pick up a dirty laundry. Hold on. I think I have to disable my um keyboard mouse switch thing cuz it's when I when I'm moving around, it's like moving the cursor from my other computer. Oh, hold on. Hold on one second. I'm like controlling my Mac right now. Okay, yeah, that's better. All right, pick up dirty laundry. Is there, where's the, where's the laundry? Yes, yeah, Synergy. I'm using Synergy. <laughs> you guessed it. I tried using the the free version um, before they started making people pay for it. I forget what it was called. I tried using it. It didn't really work. So then I just bought it. Yeah, me with the two computers. I stream from my Mac. Okay, where's the where's the laundry? Oh, it's right there. The thing with the big arrow. <laughs> the old version of source sword. No, I I tried it. It didn't work. Load washer and turn on. Oh, that's a dryer. Okay. <laughs> Hold E to fill. Okay, we'll put it in. Hold the E button. Yo, look at that. Remember, time stood idle is time wasted. Maintenance, Maintenance and cleaning. Okay, we're picking up trash. Yo, it's just like lawnmower simulator. Find some trash. Is this trash? Is this kind of trash? Press E to pick up trash. Look at that. Superb. Pick up this... This trash right here. Who's leaving their coffee? A bunch of coffee... Coffee addicts. Got a can. There's a can right here. Totally tubular. I can't put it in the trash can. I have to like put it outside. Okay. Um, uh, there's more trash. I like the arrows that tell you where the trash is. When was the last time you ever been to a laundromat? I don't remember. I don't know if I've ever been into one. Like, I'm actually not sure. Okay, I have the trash. I have more trash. Dispose of trash. Press E near the dumpster. Is this a dumpster? Here's a dumpster. Yo, it's like a video video game. Okay, I failed. <laughs> I failed. What? How? <laughs> I failed. I failed to throw the trash bag into. Okay, I I didn't understand what they were trying to. It just disappeared. Isn't that better than it going in the trash? It just like disappears. Okay, collect the wet clothes. Welcome, Toaster. I'm already disposing of all this chat. What do you mean? You're the one who implied that they're they're trash? 
Okay, collecting the clothing. Fill the dryer. Here you go. <clears throat> well, he's putting, or she, he or she, they are putting the clothing in. Your reputation is your I don't see what's on the bottom left. What does it say? A laundrette? Is that another term for laundromat? <laughs> Hello, Cyani. Welcome. Laundromats aren't a thing here. Yeah, I don't. I don't think I've ever been to one. I do walk past one sometimes, though. Um, on the way to the train station, I see one. There's people in there. Your watch or PDA will sometimes alert you to jobs. I see. Only on holiday, aren't washing machines cheap enough these days anyway? Maybe. I'll fix the toilet. The toilet's broken. Where's the toilet? Right here. Come Press... What does that mean? <laughs> what? Find the sweet spot? Plunge? 30... <laughs> what is this game? What's happening? Interesting game. Interesting idea for a game. Wow. Okay. Wait, I'm the one doing this? The customers don't do this on their own? I thought this was like a, like a self-serve kind of place. Drop off clean washing. Where? Over here. I see. So they just leave their stuff here and they want me to do it for them? Okay. I guess that that's probably a thing that people do. Okay, we're going back here. This is where the arcade machines are. Let's go. We can play some games. Mr. Bean episode? What? Fix the toilet. Give me an objective. Should I just be playing these games? Sometimes your watch will alert you of important events. Go to the office and turn on the PC. Okay. Is the office not... Uh, the office is this way? Oh, look at that. Yo, remember the screensaver? You guys have the screensaver Windows 95? <laughs> the maze? Okay, this is actually Windows 95. All right. Well, super nerd. I'm the manager. I'm managing. I'm 19. I'm the manager at the age of 19. Whoa. There's a giant rat. You type really slowly. I type really slowly. <laughs> Is this Windows 98 or 95? It looks like 95 to me. <clears throat> you think I'm going to read this? No. I'm not reading this. eBay. <laughs> eBay, but with uh, British pounds. Wait, is this in England? Are we British? Or is that just like a style thing? eBay. Hello, Jose. Oh, I should maybe I should actually read this. <laughs> uh, 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 sure. Have you emptied the machine hoppers? 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 The things that catch the that catch the coins? Oh yeah, those the hoppers, like from Minecraft. Gather the coins? Okay. Hold Q to exit the PC. Okay, collect cash from the hoppers. Press control to crouch. Alright. Yo, it's stealth mode now. <laughs> Are we British? Yo, $250 from this? That's pretty good. How long has... has it been? 137. Okay, let's get the tokens. One dollar and five dollars. Put the money in the safe. Where's the safe? Ah, yes. I like that it tells me where to go. It tells me exactly what I need to do. I'm sure at some, some point later on, I'll have to actually think for myself. But for now, I like I like this. Rotate? Wait, what am I doing? <laughs> oh, no. What, what do you want from me? Where's... Where's the, the, where's the arrow? <laughs> There's supposed to be like an arrow somewhere that... 
Am I missing something? I know there's a thing on the top, uh, the top left. It says to point the arrow that way. I don't see, where's the arrow? What does this mean? What, what am I doing? Oh wait, the arrows? Wait, hold on, what? The arrow's at the top. Combination is 159. What do you mean? Oh, I, 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 okay. Don't you, for these, don't you have to like turn it around three times? I forget. It's been such a long time since I've used one of these, but... No, I'm thinking of combination locks. These might be different. Okay, one. <laughs> or it could be two. It could be two. Two. I think it's two. Two, and then... No, I, I don't... I don't, I don't know. I don't, can you guys... <laughs> I, I wish they would give me like an actual tutorial here. Are you sure? It's 159. Ah, oh, shoot. It's 2, 2, and then 15, and then 9. No, 216. <laughs> what the heck is this? Is that not how you do it? 2, do I have to go around? 216, 9. Oh, shoot. Whatever. I don't get it. Am I gonna have to look this up? Oh no. Oh no, am I what is it? okay. <clears throat> let's 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 ask Google. Let me look at look look this wait, it zooms in sometimes. What does that mean? Does that mean I have it correct? Three? Wait, oh, it just says press E. What? <laughs> what? Excuse me? I just rotate until it says press E. Five? What? Imagine doing this in real life. Just just <laughs> spin it until it zooms in. Until your vision zooms in on the correct number. Only money placed in the safe can be spent. I'm so confused. Oh, we have a new message. Oh my gosh. I emptied them. <clears throat> Can I move the windows around? They didn't simulate that. Holy cow, holy cow. You can use a stethoscope? Really? Does it do that in real life? Those things, I bought them years ago for the customers. Dad loathed the idea, but I thought they had a certain appeal. Is this my sibling? Leslie and Ashley? Two siblings? What if I bought more? Newer games, better machines. We're going to turn this into a arcade paradise. That's where the title drop comes in. Oh yeah, that is true. I guess if you're, if you're watch watching stuff... You want to be able to use your time wisely, right? People in these days, they probably didn't have phones. They didn't have smartphones. And so if you had an arcade machine in the back, they could just be playing arcade games while they wait. Genius idea, yes. Genius idea. Holy cow, welcome, Hamflow. Welcome. Yes, don't remind me. Buy cabinets. I think in this game, so you... You can get arcade machines, but you can also actually play them. Okay. I want to buy... Which one looks good? There's only one. Yo, Stack Overflow, just like the, um... Just like... The website that programmers use. I will buy it. It has to be my first purchase. $500 Stack Overflow. That was 1993. Also, is this is this state format uh British? <laughs> wait, wait a second. No, this is dollars. We're being paid. We're paying in dollars, but the eBay is like British. Like, what is this state format? Is this is this British? When they put the the day and then the month and then the year. 
You guys have a preference. I prefer I prefer year and then month and then day. Because when you're if you're a programmer, you can sort it. Right? You can sort it alphabetically and then it'll it'll actually just work. The day format is the common. Oh, I forgot to enable my uh my redeems. Hold on one second. Do that. ISO 8601. Maybe. I don't remember the numbers off the top of my head. Okay, let me... I got your redeems. You're gonna hear the Windows sound. Windows USB connect and disconnect sound. Okay, my new machine will be delivered tomorrow morning. That's fast. Next day shipping? Nice. Day month year is the normal one. <laughs> That's the normal way to you guys? Yeah, America is month day year. People are used to day, month, year, what the heck? Oh, remember these? PDAs. Alright. What am I doing? Press E. The business is open from 8 till 11 and will generate profit while you're on the premises. You can check the time on your watch by holding tab. Oh, look at that. It's 13... something. I can't tell. 1356 right there, you can see it. Is this one of, this is like one of those real-time games? Not real-time, but like... You have to do things efficiently. <laughs> you can continue working, play some games, or end the day by heading to the bus stop, I see. Did you have that watch? Okay, what am I doing? Start menu. So why is my mouse cursor? <laughs> my mouse cursor is on the screen? It feels like that should not be happening. No friend, no friends. No friends. How do I, uh, how do I exit? How do I exit this? Escape? Tab? E? Do I hold E? Hold <laughs> Control? A? They, they showed me before. Wait, what was it? S? D? F? E? <laughs> I'm just pressing all the buttons. R? Oh, Q. Yes, of course. They should just put that, like, on there. In case you forget. Also, why is my mouse cursor on the screen? Can you fix this? That's messed up. Oh, no. <laughs> That's messed up. Why Why would you do this? This is gonna bother me so much. Okay, let me... Settings? Oh, God. Look at this. <laughs> Look at this. V-Sync, yes. Turn that... Is that on? Yes, That's on? I can't even click it. Also, it doesn't match up with where my mouse cursor is. Is that Macintosh PC? No. Wait, it does match. Wait. Okay, before the mouse cursor? Uh, you know what? I don't know. I'm so confused. Nancy Yellow saying V-Sync. I think it's on. All this stuff is on. To do. Continue playing the game. <laughs> this is an old page. I love Printer Man. Oh, my cursor's off the screen. Oh, look at this a guy. There's a guy here. What? He just... What the heck? Holy frick. <laughs> this, uh, this place is haunted. Might need to alt-tab out and in to remove the cursor. No, it's still there. Is that a ghost? What are you... Oh my god. Look at, he's becoming pig- he's- <laughs> He's Minecraft. He's become Minecraft. Okay, what do I want to do? Do I want to- Yo, there's people in here now. Oh, oh my god. Are, are we okay? Is this- oh my god. Okay, there's gum. Clean off the gum. Press E to clean the gum. Ew, <laughs> that's gross. Gross. Twenty dollars for that? All right. I don't like how the people just disappear. There's gum on here. People just be leaving their gum everywhere. Oh no. They got hidden packages. What? What is this game? Toilet is clean. Um. Hello, oh, uh, no. Hello. What would you like? Nope. I think we're just imagining everyone. Everyone here is fake. Okay, we're gonna do some laundry. 
difficult to need to fill. You want to multitask. Take this. Put that in there. Put the clothing in. This is one of those games that presumably once I get used to the gameplay loop, I can just talk over it. For now, we're focused exclusively on the gaming. What else? What else is there? Some next level money laundering. It, it is a laundry mat. Where else would you launder? Singles? 250? Triples? 450. I don't know what that means. No pets? We are not responsible for lost or damaged clothing. Oh yeah, I should be, um... People leave trash? Am I supposed to be picking up the trash? No. I wish there was music. Can I turn on, like, the radio? I don't like that it's so quiet. In case of equipment failure... What am I doing? What am I do <laughs> I go to the to-do? What am I doing? Give me more instructions. Llama, wait, the llama from Fortnite? Oh, this is like the, the Chrome. <laughs> the Chrome when you have no internet access. D jumping dinosaur game. Alright, let's play, let's play some video games, huh? Vaser Chaser. You got, um... Whatever this is, <laughs> you can do karaoke stream. Let's do single play. Oh, this is uh, air hockey. Can I click it? Is is W A S D? Whoa. This is a bit. This is a bit underwhelming. <laughs> it's going so slow. What's happening? This computer player is not very good. Yo. Anyway, how's everyone's Friday doing? You guys having a having a nice Friday? I won. Whoa, what, you, what is that about? I conducted an interview today, as usual. Uh I know I said like usually in interviews it's cool if you just talk a lot. I feel like the person that I interviewed today, he talked too much. I would ask him a question, and then he would just go on for like, 10 minutes. <laughs> and be like, normally that's good, but... I don't know. Maybe it was a bit much. But I'm not gonna deduct points from him. I'm just- that's just an- that's just an observation. Oh no. Hello Spartan Janitor. This is a great Friday. First week of job- oh, you have a new job? Very nice, nice. Amazing. I hope your job is going well. Oh no, it's time. It's time. I have to leave. Can I... How do I exit? How do I exit? Q? Hold Q? Okay. I like... This guy sets like an alarm for like when the wash is done. Interesting. Long talks mean they're passionate? Yeah, yeah. He's very knowledgeable. How can I? Oh, I have to. Right, I have to, I have to do this first. I can't just pick them all up. Okay, get this one. You said that was your strategy, not giving them room to talk. Yeah, that's why I'm hypocritical. I can do it, but if other people do it too much, you no, know, that's the thing though. Like, I asked him a question, and I feel like he started answering, but his answer didn't really answer my question. So then I had to be like, okay, like five minutes later. <laughs> I mean, it's partially my fault. I could have stopped him and be like, hey, I mean, I know you're passionate about this, but like, it's not actually what I'm asking. But uh, we had extra time left. I thought he was actually, he's like probably the most knowledgeable in terms of like Scala programming skills of all the people I've interviewed. So that was good. Uh, actually... Actually, my coworker who interviewed him next, he was like, you know, this this guy I, I'm interviewing. He said he wanted you, he wanted you to do a talk, at one of his meetups. He says you're very knowledgeable about Scala. I was like, wait, really? <laughs> what me? I just asked him a question. That's all I did. 
Oh, we can pick up trash in here. Look, I was just I was just asking him questions. Start talking about he he brought politics and religion into like in in uh in Scala. There's a type called either, and it's usually used for error handling. And uh, either has two possible values, left and right. I think by convention, people use right to be the correct thing and left to be the incorrect thing. He was like, oh yeah, I don't like I don't like how they use either in Scala. And it's like. I didn't grow up with no political system. I don't really know left and right and which one is good and which one is bad. I'm always confused. Just like, no, it's just like... It's just convention. They just chose right to mean right as incorrect. And left to be incorrect. It's like, oh, I never thought about it this way. Collect more trash? Okay, I can't just... That's not enough for you. You have to, like, collect more trash to go in, in there. Clean the gum. Oh no. People just leaving gum all over the place. Yeah, not as bad. I don't know. What's going on? Okay. Gross. Uh, okay. I haven't been reading chat. Hello, Yuyuko. Today's Friday has been mid. When did people start saying that? When did people start saying this is mid? So I feel like it's a fairly recent thing. I haven't... I'm not aware of this new slang. People just saying things. What is mid? When did people start saying mid? It's Friday has been mid. Dog sitting? Yeah, dog sitting. Okay, the dryer is done. It's pretty recent. That's what I thought. Okay, we are removing the clothing from the washer. We're putting it right here. Putting it back. Um, where's the other one? Here? I should probably just put them next to each other. Did he really? He did. Hello, Jose. What's your Steam user? When do you like to know? My my user profile on Steam is private. So you can't, even if I told you, you can't see it. It could have been up or down, and just opposite direction to mid. <laughs> mid. Okay, the washer, the washing is done. Grab the laundry. Let's put it in this one. Anyway, yes, I was surprised. I didn't think he'd be like, oh yeah. The guy who interviewed me, he just asked me like a question. <laughs> and then I talked for five minutes. I would like this guy to speak at my at my meetup. He was very knowledgeable. He, he, he did a lot of like... He speaks at conferences and all that stuff. I don't think we've ever had someone like that. Maybe it gets the point across. That sounds pretty mid to me. Is it like a like a gamer thing? <laughs> do people do normies say mid, or is it like an internet thing? What's going on? I would so I can hop in your games. I don't play multiplayer games, really. I don't do that. Mid is pretty useful, it's like saying meh. I feel like, what would I say? I, I would say like, it was okay, it was mediocre, it was decent. I feel like mediocre. Mediocre is supposed to mean like, just average slash okay, but I feel like it's taken on a negative connotation. I remember when I played Neopets, there was a there's a mini game called The Wheel of Mediocrity. And I I thought it meant it was bad. It just means it's like it's average. The business will no longer generate any cash. If you stay too late after closing time, you may pass out. Okay, let's the washer the washing. I should check the time, huh? That's late. Okay, it's 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 done. Just just finish it. What if I just leave? What if I just leave? <laughs> Hello, Bingo, Congo, Dongo. Welcome to Creed and Cast. It's a good stand-in for mediocre. You know what? Okay, that's valid. That's valid. I would like to... You know, I'm just leave. I'm just leaving. I'm out of here. I'm done with this. It's time to go home. Oh, that's a fast bomb. Holy frick. 
That boss is just zoomed in. It's zooming. Okay, we made income from the arcade, a laundromat, maintenance. Cool. Whoa, what? That's our delivery. That's our... That's our... That seems like a dangerous way to do it. Just leave it out in the sidewalk like that. Not even on the sidewalk, just like on the road. Arcades are delivered in the morning. Arcade machines, I mean. You can open the map and move cabinets around by tapping tab. Place your new machine in an empty slot using E. Okay. I put it here. Tab. I'd like to put... Put it here. To move a machine, simply... I would simply pick the machine and then move and select where I want to place it. Yeah, so let's move... Um. No, that's fine. This is fine. Some unique machines can't be moved. Okay. Placing... What the heck was that? <laughs> Placing less popular machines next to very popular ones may give them a boost. Okay, this is like... Very manager is like a manager type of game. Everyone is speeding. Everyone's just going fast. Look at that. That's a cop car. Dang. And dang old police officers. This place is dirty. Let's pick up the trash. Let's pick up the garbage. Bag is full. Okay, I see. I kept I kept the trash from yesterday. <laughs> Alright, that's good enough. For uh, 20, you get $20 for throwing trash. Oh, amazing. Okay, let's do let's do the laundry. Wait, was that is that the laundry from yesterday? They just left it overnight. They just okay, they're just leaving the laundry. <laughs> I see, okay. Those customers must be must be sad. Pick up this one. It's still in use. Okay, let's grab this stuff. Let's put that on the counter. Laundry complete rank C because I took too long. Because <laughs> I took a whole day to do it. Hello, Pink Popo. Rank C, okay. Yeah, I just I just left. It said I wouldn't be making any money if I if I stayed overnight. So I just I'm just gonna leave. If you're not gonna pay me, I'm just gonna leave. People just leaving the trash on the floor. Look at this, look at this. You should be upset. Look at you. Okay, you're gone. You're just gone. Okay, you know, I think I I, I wanna put some music on because it's like weirdly quiet. I put that Spotify lo-fi BGM on in the background. Here we go. Um, yes, listen on this computer. Here we go. Whoops. The wrong song. Okay. That was the previous song was Kore Sawa, one of her new songs. It was loud. What was that song called? I forget. That was that was probably really loud. Um. Okay. Now I have to go back to the game. I hope the game pauses when I'm in this menu. <laughs> what if your customers are actually the trash? You throw away. Oh no. Really makes you think. Okay. This guy's gone. A literal trash game. Okay, pick up the... <laughs> pick up the gum. People just leaving gum, like, all the time. You guys ever, like, when you were in school, did people, like, leave gum underneath the tables? It always bothered me so much. Dude, that's gross. It's, like, dried out. I just leave them there. Look, they're just leaving... Crushed soda bottles here. But yeah, why don't you pick gum with your hands? I don't know. You're just built. I'm just built different. I'm simply built different. 
Oh, my bag is full? Okay. I feel like with this kind of job, you should, yeah, you should be wearing gloves. Zero dollars? What? Why did I get twenty dollars last time? People leaving their pizza boxes. There's so much trash here. Look at this garbage. Yes, I'm simply built different. Yes. What if, what if these are gloves? What if they're just like human, <laughs> human colored gloves, human skin colored gloves? They have the they have the texture. Toilet is clean. Okay. Someone don't put the don't put the gum in there. It wasn't thrown in the center. Does that matter? <laughs> Does it really matter? These people don't know how to do their own laundry. They're just standing around. Waiting for me, made, waiting for like the one person to do them. Okay, this one's done. Big boys, burger customers. Is that the, that's the name of the burger place? I actually didn't even take a look. Okay, there's trash, there's trash right here. What else was it? Okay, one of these are done. This one's done. It's not done. I got like a beeping notification for something. What's going on? It's worse. Oh, I have new laundry to do. Alright. What else is there? Can I play game? I'm gonna play some games while I wait. What's this new one I bought? Stack Overflow? Let's play it. Insert coin. Press space. Clothes in the dryer are done. Wait, no. What is this game? <laughs> what am I doing? I'm not sure. Is this Tower of Hanoi? Am I stacking things? Stacktastic job. Wait, okay. Clothes in the dryer are done. Okay, let's try it. Oops. Are they done? This one's done. Oh, this one's done. I like these kinds of games. They're, uh, menial chore simulators. Yeah, Stack Overflow. I, I made that joke. I understand. I totally, I, I made that exact joke. Okay, so these are real time. It tells you in one minute. 48. And the baskets on the floor in front of the dryers indicates. Oh, yeah, you're right. You're right. It really makes you think, huh? Okay, we have. We can play some more Stack Overflow. I'm, I'm guessing I just have to, like, try to get the. What's. Try to get them stacked with the same color on top of each other. Kind of like this. Just have to do it fast. Here we go. Um, anyway, yes, I conducted an interview today. And then I... This is this is the day when I told my manager that I am going to leave the company. So I gave I gave my two and a half weeks notice. It was actually uh, we were supposed to have a one on one today, but I had like a meeting scheduled. I had like the interview that I did was actually conflicting with the one on one with my manager, and so I was like, hey, can we reschedule the <laughs> the one on one meeting? Um, he was like, oh, I I, could, I don't really have that much time. I can. I can do it on Monday if you want, or like sometime next week if you don't have anything important. And this is the one time that I actually had something to say. So I was like, I would really prefer if we could do this, uh... <laughs> we could do this on, uh, on today. He was like, alright, I can do 1pm. And then... As soon as we went, went into the meeting, I was like, oh yeah, I'm leaving. <laughs> it's like, okay, yeah, I knew, you know, I was afraid of this when you said you had something to talk about. I was hoping it wasn't this, but you know what? Okay. I guess that's how things go. 
It's always weird to have those conversations. I was considering not doing it on Friday, but I feel like the earlier the better. Right? Otherwise, it gives them, it gives them, it ruins their weekends, right? <laughs> but I mean, he was like, I actually mentioned that. I was like, I was considering, you know, if you mentioned waiting until next week, I could have done that. But then I was like, I should probably do it sooner than later. And so now he knows that I'm leaving. Welcome, Caleb Paris. I would love a built-in arcade while I'll wait on my laundry to get done, but those don't exist in America. And when was the last time you've seen a laundromat? Or have been inside one? Because I was talking about this at the beginning of the stream. I haven't been to one. Possibly ever. I've walked by a few of them. Like, I wonder how much these places make money, right? How do you, like, it costs 25 cents or how much does it cost? <laughs> a dollar to wash your stuff? Doesn't the cost of water cost more than that? Oh, Robomu, thank you for the resub. Two months. The ones near me have old machines. Yeah. Why are all the he's you the games you play just entry entry level jobs? Cause they're fun. They're easy to talk over. They are convenient. Okay, let's play some video games. What's this one? Oh it's this is uh this is Pac-Man but rebranded as um Grand Theft Auto. <laughs> I think all these all these arcade games are references to existing games, but made so that they're legally distinct. Yeah, so this one is Grand Theft Auto. Grand, Grand Theft Auto. Oh, okay. What the heck? I'm a tank now. I'm guessing the tank is what you can use to that they just crush the crush the cars. Oh no. Yeah, busted. Just like it's <laughs> like Grand Theft Auto. Yeah, they're playable. Playable minigames. Okay, the wash is done. Let's wash this one. Put this one in here. 2019 was the last time I was in one. They were like this, but, but no arcade. Yeah. I feel like arcade, having an arcade in one of these is a, is a good idea. But I think nowadays everyone has like a smartphone. They could just be playing games on their phone. But this game takes place in the 90s, and so people didn't have games on their phone. I mean, some people have PDAs, right? They have these things. But those are those are pretty rare. I don't think I've ever actually seen one. They just make people disappear by walking into them. I had Snake. Oh yeah, I had Snake. Yeah. Nokia phones came pre-installed with Snake. Alright, one of these is done. These two are done. I literally play PS2 games on the phone. Nice. What's, what's the best phone game from back in the day? I know Snake was the most common one. Are there all this? This is like Space Invaders, right? Probably. Rank B. Nineties, we really loved our video games. Yeah, because there was nothing else to do. I've talked about this. Like as a kid, you're just like, you buy a game. Looking back at it, it's like it's not actually that good. It's like I had nothing else to play, so you just spent many hours playing the same game until you got good at it. Nowadays, if a game's not good, you're just like, I have no patience for this. I would simply spend my time doing something else. Snake and this side shooter game on the same Nokia model. I don't, yeah, I don't know if I've ever had a Nokia phone. I don't know, some sort of side scrolling shooter game. Let's pick up the gum. Your phone must literally be on fire. Welcome, Nocturnal. I feel like... I don't know if I'm, like, getting motion sick somehow from this. I feel like the camera just moves around really fast. 
I feel like I'm sweating. It's like the VR sweats, but I'm not even in VR. I can't tell if I'm sweating because of like motion sickness or because this game is actually or because it's hot. <laughs> right? You ever get that? You're just like sweating and you're like, am I like, is this a cause of motion sickness or mouse acceleration is on? What's the settings? Can I like disable that? Mouse sensitivity, redefine control, sprint mode, zoom mode, crosshair. I decrease the mouse sensitivity. <laughs> It still feels like, I don't know, it feels like something's wrong. Uh, motion blur? Is there motion blur? Settings. Video options. There's a lot of options. So HDR, shadow, dynamic resolution, render scale. <laughs> bloom? Should I turn bloom off? What is bloom? A vignette? V-Sync? V-Sync is on. I, I need to have V-Sync on. Oh, field of view is tiny. Is that what it is? <laughs> Can I set this to like, at least 80? Why can't they change this? Field of view. Can I change this? <laughs> Can I, how do I do this? Oh no. 45 as a field of view feels really small. Uh, I feel like I can't move. This. Oh wait! Oh, I just use I use the arrow keys. Maximum FOV is sixty. Really? Oh no. Uh, v sync bloom and yet tone mapping. I don't even know what most of these are. Split toning. HDR shadow dynamic resolution. I don't know, something, something about this just feels... Yeah, 60, 60 feels really small. I knew something was wrong with the default of 45, that's tiny. Alright, well, maybe this is better. Uh, wash is done. 80 or 90, yeah, I usually set it to like 85 or 90. No, 60 is just like, it's like nothing. V-Sync sometimes feels like ice movement. I think with the with the way that my my streaming setup is, if I don't have V-Sync on, uh, you get vertical tearing sometimes. Like I noticed when I when I played House Flipper and I didn't have V-Sync on, it just looked awful. Uh, I think the same thing when I, when I stream TF2 on here, I noticed vertical tearing. And so uh, now I learned I have to have it on. All right, there's there's more clothing here. Oh yeah, I should be checking the time. I should not be doing more laundry if the days if the time is too late. It's it's 8 p.m. ish. V sync uh, vertical synchronization. I'm pretty sure the V stands for vertical. You get a lot of terror. It depends, I guess it depends on your monitor. Uh, the way I'm streaming this is it's going through an Elgato capture card into into OBS, so I'm playing through OBS. And so it's very noticeable. I think when people stream, right, if it's going directly to your monitor, viewers probably don't notice if there's vertical tear. But since I'm streaming the output to OBS, you, you will see it if there's issues. 9 out of 10 games I play require me to turn on V-Sync? Yeah. I know, doesn't it make sense? Like, V-Sync is, uh, it syncs up the, the rate to the rate of your monitor, right? Is that what it is? I don't know. I don't think my monitor, my monitor is like 60 FPS. Or 60 Hertz. Yeah. I guessed correctly. new GPU. I have a 3060 Ti. I checked a while back. Um, the computer I have, it's a NZXT H1 Mini. H1 Mini Pro. 
But when I checked the website last time, they I, I think they did like a refresh of their models. Right, the one that I have is actually not as powerful as the one on their website. Actually, the one on their website now, H1 Mini Pro, it's like 2000 something dollars. And like, I definitely did not pay 2000 for this one. Uh, so I think... I don't know, it's out of date. Yeah, 3060 Ti. I didn't know, like, before I got this computer, I didn't know there was a difference between, like, I didn't know what the Ti stood for. I thought it meant, like, just slightly better than the 3060. Apparently the 3060 Ti is, like, significantly better than the 3060. I was like, I never would have guessed. I have no way of knowing. Anyway. FreeSync is the same thing. The prices are going down pretty high for high-end cards. Yeah, wasn't there, like, some crypto thing? There's, like, people stopped... Stopped doing the crypto. Crypto market is... is down or something. <laughs> 30 80s have halved. I think it's true that uh it's probably cheaper to get a graphics card if you buy a pre-built. Or at least that was the case when when I got mine. I don't know. They still aren't worth it. They're probably worth it if like I don't have any computer. <laughs> I don't have any sort of computer to play on until now. Also, it's closing time for the business. How long is this going to take? 43 seconds? You know what, I'll just... Uh, I'll wait. I think I'll wait. Just wait 30 seconds. I believe it's not due to crypto, but superconductor companies... Recovery. Oh. Did they have issues with uh, making graphics cards? Actually, I guess full disclosure, um, since I didn't get a job there, I did apply to NVIDIA. That was one of the places that I was looking at. I think when I applied, uh, I checked like a week later, they took down the job listing. And so I guess they found someone. But I didn't know, they, they have positions that do rust. They're not working on like the actual graphics cards, but I think they have some like cloud cloud platform that renders stuff. It's like you know how like Pixar has their own render farm and stuff like that. I think Nvidia has their own thing called like Omniverse or something. And um they have some sort of back-end thing. I don't know. I thought I was like, oh that seems cool. I'll look into it. I did apply, and then they found someone, so... <laughs> there you go. You get a 3070 pre-built for like 1k? Dang. Like with the other stuff? With the computer? Superconductor companies are struggling to meet the demands of sudden increase of electronics due to work from home. I feel like with, uh, with the graphics cards, I guess it would affect every every sort of electronics industry, right? I think I think when uh, when work from home was a thing, well, it's still a thing, but like webcams also became really expensive. Right? I remember when I when I bought a webcam for for VTube Studio. I think a bunch of the reviews were like, "Oh yeah, prices have gone up for this standard webcam because." Uh, a lot of people need it for their work, work I can't talk, for, for their uh, work from home stuff. So what the heck? Alright, I need to hydrate. I'm definitely, it's time to hydrate. Also, my, um, my stream deck stopped working for some reason. It, the OBS, I don't know if I had to, I had to like restart OBS or something. But I can't. The buttons don't do anything right now. Okay, let me hydrate. Oh, I can't even- I can't even toggle the, um... The thing. <laughs> what is it? The... The cup. Oh, no. I can't toggle the, the drinking thing. Oh, well.
Okay. I just I had to do the thing that VTubers do when they when they hydrate and you just see them move their mouths like this. Yeah, it, it feels weird to not have uh, a cup of water. A cup of water. Let's see, NVIDIA had to tell their investors they had to readjust their earnings. They admitted they were making a killing on selling to crypto farms. Not surprising. It's like the main customers at this point. They don't care about the gamers. They're just here to make money from crypto. I don't know. I just used my phone camera. I refuse to buy a webcam. Yeah, I think there's um there's programs, there's apps you can download on your phone that connect to your, to your computer. You can use that as a webcam. And I feel like it always uses up like a lot of battery though. It's like a pretty resource intensive. So I know when I use VTube Studio like on my on my phone, it just uh it heats up a lot. I think because the webcam is on. It's doing uh, it's doing processing. Anyway, let's pick up some more trash. Let's pick up some gum. Wow, okay, my bag is full. Time to throw the trash. Okay, let's do this mini game. That was bad. Okay, I got 10 bucks for it though. <laughs> yeah, I like the part where I say is hydrate in time. It really makes you think a lot about society. It's like... Oh, he's right. It is hydrate in time. It's the time when he does the hydration. As a society, we should aim to hydrate more often. Because it's, it's essential for survival. As human beings... You guys know like 70 something percent of your body is water and yet we still need to drink so much of it wow what's up with that so i don't know if i said welcome cole did i say that i saw you here earlier <laughs> i didn't i don't know if i said welcome cole hello android 10 by default allows you to use it use the phone as a webcam whoa what I had no idea. That seems useful. War tour, war turtle. Yeah, twenty bucks for the gum. Okay, let's play. Oh, have we played this one? We haven't played this one yet. Wood gal's adventure. These are advanced graphics for the time. I'm not reading this. I'm on a schedule. <laughs> oh, this is this is Connect Three. What is happening? Did I just I just did something? This is one of those Match Three games. I think there's some sort of strategy strategy to this, but I'm not sure. I don't really know how this stuff works. I'm just pressing buttons. Okay, there's a cake. There's a thing right here. Yo, look at that. That was amazing. Thanks. Well done. Off-brand off bejeweled. Look, there's a slime. Slime climb? Okay. Hold on. What's the point of strategy when you just get lucky? I think the strategy makes it more likely that you can get lucky, I don't know. Right, just like card games, card games are basically mostly RNG. Not even RNG, I, I feel like people say RNG as if that's like a thing. It's real life though, you're drawing the card in real life. It's not really the random number generator, it's just like, just randomness. But yeah, card games are random. But there's things you can do to minimize the randomness, right? If you play your cards right, you, you do like card draw, and it reduces the amount of RNG. I keep saying RNG. If we have 100% water in our body, we would internally drown. Would we though? 
Are you sure? How much water do fish have in their bodies? You ever think about that? What percentage? If humans are 70% water, what about fish? What percentage is our fish? Look at this trash. I, I think really the goal of this game is to replace most of these washing machines with uh, arcade machines. But I think I'm just like doing the mundane thing. I'm just like, you know what? This is fine. I'm fine if the entire game is just me uh, taking out the trash doing the laundry. <laughs> People have died from water poison. What? Oh yeah, if you drink like too much water, it, it's bad for you. True. It's very true. No, no, it has, it has never happened to me yet. There was a there was a Wii giveaway contest to see who could drink the most water. What? I've heard also that it's really bad if you drink a lot of milk, right? Apparently, there's like a certain number of cups of milk that if you drink it, your body just like... I don't know. It's just like really bad for you. Also, eggs. Can't eat too many eggs. Otherwise, it's bad. Yeah, five gallons of milk. That's a lot of milk. What percentage of water does a thing need to be before you can drink it? Um... I don't know. Yeah, if it's like solid, I mean, you drink a... What, what percentage of water is a milkshake? I don't know. Oh, man. Anything in excess is bad. You can poison yourself with chocolate. What's the, what's the most, like, mundane thing you could poison yourself by eating too much of? That's probably not a very well-defined question. It could be anything. This guy, this guy touched too much paper. Now his skin is all broken from all the paper he's been touching. Alcohol, rice, brown rice, Tide Pod. Okay, these are, there's some very varied, varied things in here. Eggs are high cholesterol. What really, what really is cholesterol, anyway? I remember a long time ago, there there used to be ads on TV about like how bad cholesterol was. I specifically remember, actually, there was like one commercial of like a guy like in a swimming pool. He was doing like a dive and he like fell off and they're like, cholesterol, it's bad for you or something. I'm just like, what does that have to do with cholesterol? Like as a kid, I used to think like cholesterol made it more likely for you to fall down. I don't know, like, I just, that commercial just didn't explain anything to me. Then they're just like, oh, there's like, there's good cholesterol, there's bad cholesterol, there's like... What's that called? LDL and HDL or something? I don't know. Side effects of eating may include choking to death. That can happen to with anything, though. Literally everything. All right. It makes things sticky. Oh no. Yo, look at that. <laughs> Good luck. Look at this riveting gameplay. I never really understood the appeal of uh, match three style games. Right, like, I don't really know what I'm doing. I'm just, like, moving shapes, like, randomly. Like, there's just probably some technique to it to, like, get... <laughs> optimize this. It's like, I don't know, I'm just do. I'm just going fast. I'm just making suboptimal decisions. <laughs> Thanks, bro. <laughs> what? The game plays itself, true. You can pet the dog. You can pet the dog. Yeah, me- whoa, now there's- what- what is this? Up oh, is time to... It's time to put the thing... Into the dryer.
From health.org, cholesterol is a waxy substance. It's not inherently bad, your body needs it. But too much can pose a problem. Yeah, there's like good and bad cholesterol. Um, at our workplace, when we used to have an office, they, they used to have like annual, um, we call them biometric screenings. They would take like a, like a prick, they'd take like a prick from your, from your finger, draw some blood. And then they would have some results, very quickly. They're like, this is, this is how much good cholesterol you have. This is how much, how much bad cholesterol you have. And mine were always in a good range. They're just like, this is good. I'm like, thank you. I tried my best. I didn't try, like, at all, but... Hypothetically. If I did try, then... It would have been my best. I would have tried my best. Oh no, this is so much... Okay, the dryer is done. I don't think I'll be playing more of this game after this stream because I think... I don't know, something about the camera, it's just like, it's really weird. It's like the FOV or like the, the mouse acceleration or something. It's just very... It's very unsettling. Using 10%. Yeah, it's, it's it's holding me back. If this was in real life, I would just... I would have motion sickness. There's being in the laundry. It might be like all the particles, maybe? There's like all this stuff here. Wait, what if we could power wash this? Yeah, that's, that's just how eyes were... <laughs> That's how eyes worked. Also, why is there trash in here? I'm not the only one in here. Oh wait, no, I guess, yeah, the customers come in here. I forgot. It's the pollen. It's the dandruff from all the, all the washers. Cleaning the gum. It's gross. You know, I should probably be like ordering, um, Arcade machines, because that's like that's the goal of this game, right? You're trying to set up an arcade empire. I'm like, I'm not doing any of that. Are these done? Is this done? Okay, 12 seconds for this one. Who put the gum on the trash can? Surprisingly, like a lot of people probably. I see that's like the most common place to have a gum. Just throw it in? No, they just, they're just too lazy. Maybe they tried to throw it and then they missed. Maybe they made some sort of attempt. Okay, what is it? Can I go buy, um... How much money do I have? Let's buy this one. Oops. The back button doesn't work. Oh my god. The Resurrect Chinatown Fair. Is that- does that place no longer exist? I feel like with COVID being a thing, there's less people going to arcades probably. You used to swallow gum as a kid? How did- how did that turn out? I was always really afraid of that. It would get like stuck in your intestines and you're like, oh no, I'm gonna like- I'm gonna die. <laughs> I know also people said like adults will tell you if you eat watermelon seeds it'll like grow a watermelon inside your body. <laughs> you guys ever afraid of that as a kid? Say no I can't I can't eat the seeds it's gonna I'm gonna grow things inside me. But then they don't tell you there's like there's acid in your body. <laughs> it breaks down the, the things. Um Apparently, I think, like, don't apple seeds have, like, a small amount of cyanide? If you just eat a ton of apple seeds, you could die. <laughs> you can die from cyanide poison. But it has to be, like, a lot of them. 
It's like a very large amount of apple seeds. Yeah, there's not soil. Well, yeah, what if you eat the soil though? What if what if there's soil in your body? I think it still exists, but is a shell of its former self with lots of mobile to arcade cab games. Chinatown Fair, yeah. Dang. For people not familiar, that was an arcade in uh, in Manhattan. I used to go there a lot. Sorry, by was I mean is because presumably it still exists. Your stomach acid is strong enough to neutralize the acids. The um the cyanide. Yeah, but what if you just ate like a ton of them? What if- what if there's someone out there? He's just like collecting apple seeds. <laughs> he was like- he bought like a billion apples. He's like grinding up all the apple seeds. So I think I might actually have to cut the stream short today because like... I think- I think I'm actually getting motion sickness from this. <laughs> or maybe we can switch to lawn mowing simulator? I don't know. I'm feeling- I'm feeling it. I'm really feeling it. Brown rice grown in the U.S. has some amounts of arsenic. Oh yeah, that was yeah. Isn't isn't brown rice brown brown rice? Isn't brown rice just like um, unwashed white rice? Right? Is that true? Did I make that up? I don't know. I feel like I read that somewhere. I just really want to mow some more. Oh, it's unhusked rice. I see. Actually, what time is it? It's 10 p.m. Okay. I think when this day is over in this game, I'm just gonna just gonna go do something else. <laughs> the human brains, yeah, moving pictures though, motion pictures. Remember those? motion pictures the cinema when did they call them matinees remember <laughs> there's like multiple ways to say movies matinee that's one of them motion pictures cinema yeah moving pictures yeah oh what, what a novel concept pictures that move whoa Okay, business is closing. I'm just gonna leave those in there overnight. Yeah, it's like the, the train, yeah. That was the first one. It's the horror film. They had a train coming straight at the camera. How did they record that? You ever think about that? Like, back then, they didn't use, like, stop motion, right? It was like an actual train. <laughs> did the... Did the train, like crash into the camera or what yeah the camera freaking died and you're laughing it died and you're laughing all right we don't need this all right we're done we're done i'm going i'm leaving actually can i order okay i can order a um Nope. To do? Nope. Llama? Nope. How do I, um... Press E to leave. It wasn't going straight at the camera? Wait, really? It was entering the station. Wait, what? The, why did I thought the camera was like right in the front of it? All right, well that's this game. Uh, this game was pretty fun, pretty good menial chore simulator that has some arcade segments. But I think uh, since I have motion sickness, I'm just gonna do something else. I'm gonna. It's too much for me. I don't know. It's like the FOV was too low or something. 
it's too much. It's too much for me. Okay, we're quitting to desktop. We can do something else. I can <laughs> and try Cult of the Lamb. What else can I do? Maybe do Tetris. I haven't played Tetris in a while. What can I do for like an hour? Unpacking, remember that game? We could look at a random, uh, random itch games, itchy. <laughs> Paint drawing, yeah, that is an actual game. Paint drawing simulator, I saw it. There's, there's all these games that I haven't played. What is, what is Laser Cat? Spring Falls. Oh yeah, remember this game? Bento. Portal Reloaded? What is that? Is that a remake? Yeah, we can play VTube Studio. <laughs> Baldi's Basics. That's a horror game of, of some sort. I know, but it's also, it's also first person, right? I feel like I might, if I... If I keep playing first person games... Might not be a good idea, given my experience with this game. Risk of Rain. <laughs> House Flipper. Crab Game. I have all these old games, so th <laughs> there's like all these VR games that I got. They're from a bundle? This one, this one's called, this is like a guy on a boat. Shoot, interesting title. Cooking Simulator VR. Blocks. Delta. You haven't played Euro Truck Simulator in a while. Hello, Gigant Drago. Toho. I'm actually not good at Toho. Oh, Escapade, thank you for the seven months. I'm seeing that my bitrate is like, it's turning red sometimes. What's up with that? Sometimes it drops like 3k, and then turns red. Who knows? Um, hold on. Let me let me re-enable synergy. <laughs> Easy mode. Alright. I think I'm actually- I, I might just call the stream. I feel like lying down. Something about that game really messes with my head. <laughs> I don't feel well. Something- something's not- something's not right with that game. Um, let me see what today is. I'm gonna do a raid. I really wish we could have played Cult of the Lamb today, but... They're having a lot of server issues. I think the game ended up being a lot more popular than they expected. And so... The plugin just doesn't work half the time. If it works tomorrow, I'll do that. I'll, I mean, I'll do that. Um, otherwise, maybe Monday? Who knows? Um, anyway, yeah, so what day is today? International Youth Day? Milkman Day? National Gooey Butter Cake Day? National Julienne Fries Day. National Middle Child Middle Child Day. Vinyl Record Day. Shop Online for Groceries Day. Bunch of other holidays. World Elephant Day. Um, which one do I like? National National Vinyl Record Day. Sure, why not? And let's see who to raid. Who's available to be raided? Which of these people have I not raided before? I think everyone I'm following who who is online and who is a VTuber. I think I've raided all of them. Uh, we haven't raided Barry Salmon. Oh. 
think uh I think their stream usually ends before before this stream ends. Alright, let's let's raid. Paste. I have to wait for an ad. I got a Sonic ad. <laughs> Sonic ads are really weird. The way they do them, they just talk. They're just talking. Alright, here we go. Raid. Yo, Spambot. Gonna ban. Is it banning time? Alright, yeah. National Vinyl Record Day raid. Uh, thanks for watching. I might be back tomorrow. Cult of the Lamb. If that game works, I'll play it. I, I don't collect vinyls. It's just, that's just today. Today is vinyl record day. Sonic loves chili cheese dogs, doesn't he? Isn't that something that Sonic, the, uh, the store, the restaurant, they sell that kind of stuff? Who knows? Who knows? Yep. Thanks for watching. They do. They do be selling those. They should do a collab. <laughs> anyway, raid is going. Goodbye. I actually forgot to end my stream yesterday. If you watch the VOD, there's a part where I just didn't end. Alright, goodbye. <laughs>